It only took an email to get Travis Green back in the gamut of being a competitive athlete. Uh, I live in Boise, Idaho, so there's not a lot of adaptive sports out there, and so I jump on any opportunity that looks like a fun trip. That email led Travis to the 2010 Warrior Games in Colorado to compete against the other service branches. You know, it's so hard to find adaptive sports sometimes when you go home, and so, you know, when I was going through my recovery, sports was like the best medicine for me. Travis, along with three other Marines and one Navy corpsman, were injured in a secondary IED blast while giving aid to a wounded Marine in December of 2005. It was that IED blast in Iraq that took Travis's legs, but not his competitive spirit. You know, I was an athlete before my injury, and so to come out and find that I'm still an athlete after I lose my legs is, is a huge thing. It's that sentiment that most athletes competing in this year's Marine Corps trials brought to the table. This is just a great event. I mean, 10 days of doing sports, then you make the Warrior Games, and you got 21 days of nothing but sports. So it's just, it's heaven for me. Travis and the other athletes are living up to the Wounded Warrior Regiment's motto, still in the fight, as they edge closer to the All-Marine team. From Camp Pendleton, California, I'm Staff Sergeant Will Skelton.